Here I have a Union 5 lever, 5 gauge, curtain, deadbolt. Just got these today from uh, Pickery Paul. Um, I've got a link to his YouTube page on my YouTube homepage. So uh, check out his videos and thank you very, very much for the lots. He sent me this one. He sent me a Chubb or an ERA, a Yale, and a Chubb. So, we have a lot of videos coming up here on these. Um, have a technical entry curtain pick set that I got from uh, <laughs> from Met. Sorry, on the forums. Um, did a little trading with him, so I got this pick set. I've got a five gauge tip. I have a six gauge tip. And I have a seven gauge tip. And a couple extra pick wires. So, this one here is locked up. So, we'll go ahead and try this. The toughest part I'm having is so far is getting the picks in. Um, I'm not exactly. I didn't get any instructions, so bear with me. And if I'm doing something wrong, let me know in the comments. If I need my wire bent a different way, let me know. But so I'll put this in here. Take out this knot. Put this in here. So put both together. Wrong. Don't think they're here. We're live. That part back. So now I'm going to not know how to put the camera. I'm going to put tension up here. I'm going to put my pick. I'll just put the levers one at a time. Kind of like a pin tumbler, just going for a lever that's binding. And these don't seem to set the same way as, like, let's say a pin. Because it's not a pin, it's a lever. But the lever will lift up and bind against the post stub. Uh, or the bolt stub, I think is what you see they call it. But not set, but it will bind and hold the lever there. And then another one will bind, and you just kind of keep picking each one over and over and over. And you'll see the bolt will, uh, see it just moved a little bit right there? I got one set. As you get them set, or locked into place, they're just held against the bolt stub pressure. It'll stay in place, and just slowly move a little bit at a time until you're open. Technical difficulties here. I also need to know how to get the wire out once I pick it. That's a problem. Just got these in the mail today, so I think this might have been the easiest of the bunch since I picked it. Now we're stuck, so I can't pick any more locks because my tools are dead. Ah, there we go. No, they're not jammed. See, I was just testing everybody. But so there it is, picked open. Um, said, here's my wire. If I got something going on wrong here, let me know. I just put a little bend in the end of the wire and then screwed these together so it'll pick without bending. Um, we'll go ahead we go, and open this up. I gotta fix this light here too. See that? That stupid glare from this fluorescent. I'm not quite sure how to hold it back. But we'll get that fixed before the next video. So we'll pop this in. We'll pop this in. There it is. There's the five. Oops. The five levers. 
series number one. We'll keep these in order. I don't know if those numbers mean anything as far as depth or anything, but there's a 5-5, five, 5-3, five, five, and these don't have any kind of notches to uh, lock the bolt stub up, like some of them do, like this, uh, this one here is the ERA, and you can see it's got a window, a cheater window, but that first, that first wafer there has a little spot for the bolt to catch bolt stub to catch. So I'm guessing when I start picking this one, it's going to lock up on that one and give me issues. Maybe it'll give me some counter rotation or something. Who knows? We'll figure it out when we get there. But, 5-3. 5-4. Another 5-3. Here's the curtain. There's the bolt and the bolt stub. And then the spring that just applies pressure to the curtain. Get it back together. Oh, there it is. Hopefully, it's not going to slide behind. Okay, so that's it. Five lever, union, five gauge. Thank you again. Uh, pick and call for the locks. Very nice of you. And uh, say we're going to these next three here in the next few days, few weeks, whatever it takes. And uh, thanks for watching.